Hi, I'm Connor Williams, and welcome back to Johnny Benny Campus News, keeping you up to date on campus life and events. CSB cross country and track and field coach Robin Balder Lano will be recognized for her outstanding performance in coaching with the Breaking Barriers Award on National Girls and Women in Sports Day. In addition, Margaret Hughes, the former CSB Physical Education Department Chair, will be honored with the Marie Berg Education Award. As of January 26, there are currently 32 positive co cases of COVID-19 within the student community. As of right now, 90% of Benny's and Johnny's are fully vaccinated. For updates and resources surrounding COVID-19, please visit csbsju.edu backslash COVID-19. In upcoming events, on January 29th, the CSBSJU Orchestra will be performing with the famed Scotland fiddler Alastair Fraser and talented cellist Natalie Haas. Attendees can find more information by visiting the performances page under the Fine Arts page. The Political Science Department's discussion series, Let's Talk, will host a discussion on the current situation in the Ukraine. You can find a link to join the talk on the CSBSJU Bulletin. CSB Group Exercise will be hosting a glow-in-the-dark SEP class on February 1st. Work out in a fun environment instructed by fellow CSB students. Class will be located in the Lower Group Studio in the Hain Campus Center. More information can be found by visiting at CSB Rec on Instagram. Now we go to Zach Tallman with this week's Sports Roundup. The St. John's men's basketball team won their last game against St. Scholastica, 83-62. Sophomore Ryan Thiessen led the Johnnies with the 20 points. The Johnnies will look to keep their win streak alive as they take on Carleton College this week. The St. Ben's basketball team also won their game against St. Scholastica, 64-60. Senior Madison Doran led the Bennies with 20 points to help secure them the victory. The Bennies will also hit the road to take on Carleton College this week. The St. John's wrestling team hosted the North Country Open this past weekend. Freshman DJ Miles placed first in the 197 pound weight class along with freshman Tommy Gilmore placing second in the 197 pound weight class. The St. Ben's hockey team will start resuming their season this week as they head to Hamlin to take on the Pipers. The St. John's hockey team was victorious against Northland College. The Johnnies put up five points while Northland only put up two. Junior Peter Tobar led the Johnnies with two goals and two assists. The Johnnies will head to St. Paul to take on the Hamlin Pipers. The St. John's swim and dive team fell to St. Cloud State in their last duel despite SJU having 17 top three marks. St. John's hopes to bounce back next week as they head to St. Peter to take on Gustavus. That's it for this week's sports roundup. Be sure to tune in next week for all your Johnny Benny sports news. Thank you, Zach. That's all for this week's episode of Johnny Benny Campus News. Tune in again next time for more updates on campus life and events.